I can't. I I can't can't I can't do this right now. I, I just can't. I can't. I just can't. Like no, stop. Don't even. I, no. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. <sighs> Another. Yeah, there's your repeat. The bandwagon lives on for another year. The big market teams always win. <laughs> the teams with money always win. Uh, so, yep, there you go. Uh, it is so close. Like, God, this. I feel for the Spurs. I mean, the Spurs, they're my number two team. Like, if something ever happened to the Thunder, you know, like, I'm not saying I'm a bandwagon fan, I'll always be with the Thunder. Um, but I'm saying, like, if, if the Thunder ever just disappeared off the face of the earth, the Spurs would be my next choice. Uh, I was born in San Antonio, so, I mean, you know, that's where I would go to next. Um, but yeah. So, I mean... I have Spurs, I don't really watch their games or cheer for them much, really. Like, it's kind of like a ranking, like, I guess, like, from 1 to 30. Like, who's your second favorite team? Who's your, on your number 3, your number 4? Stuff like that. Um, so, or basically, like, who, when the Thunder get eliminated, who are you rooting for in the playoffs next? So, um, yeah. So, Spurs lost. LeBron put up 37 points, um, yeah, wanted that championship, uh, that second championship, remember, like, a year and, like, two weeks ago when people were still making no rings jokes, me too, I loved it, uh, but yeah, <laughs> I barely knew much about basketball, not nearly as much as I do now, but, um, LeBron put up 37, D-Wade put up 23, Daddy A put up 18 on 6 of 8 free or 3 point like ah uh, just put in the dagger 14 for Chalmers um so ABC does not have good memories now for me uh but this was a way hell of a better uh series than last year not dissing my thunder uh but still 5 games compared to 7 like yeah um I don't know, I just, I liked this series, even though it didn't end the way I wanted it to. Spurs broke three-point records, broke tons of, like, margin of victory. Like, they had, like, a 30 or 40, something close to that blowout. I think it was game two or three, one of those beginning ones, which was amazing to see, uh, like, the Heat getting blown out. Because usually what, usually they're involved in close game situations, um, but yeah. So, I mean, it was a good good series. ABC is going to have bad memories for me uh, just because the Spurs lost, Thunder lost on ABC. And, uh, I just wish it was, it was on TNT. Maybe the Spurs would have won. No, I'm just kidding. Um, but, yeah, congrats to the Heat. Congrats to the Heat fans who have been here longer than 2011 to 12, or, no, longer than LeBron has been there. Congrats. Um... Yeah, I mean Heat fans. If if you if you if you've been a Heat fan since before 2010, I kind of appreciate you more. Um, but if not, like 80% of their fans are like, yeah, we're here. And then 2014 happens or something. LeBron goes to the Lakers and they're like, yeah, Lakers fans again. <laughs> like we were in 2010. Woo. Or 20 2009 when they won. Woo. Like yeah. Um, so. Now basketball's over. And that's that's one of the mo more depressing parts. Like it's it's all over. Just, ah.